Hey everyone, welcome back to The List, I'm Donna Ruco. A blue October mini break and a toy kids will want, no batteries required. Mitch Webber has the three top quarters around Kansas City. At number one, our Royals won big last night. They don't play again until Friday in Baltimore, but don't worry, there is plenty to do. Catch up on some much needed sleep. Catch up on your favorite shows. Get caught up on all your blue laundry. Catch a flick with friends. At number two, that movie should be Gone Girl, the thriller based on the novel by Casey native Gillian Flynn. The hallmark of a sociopath is a lack of empathy. For the book, Gillian got legal advice from local defense attorney Molly Hastings, who gets credit in the book. It says, to Molly, who saved me from myself. Thanks, Gillian Flynn. Gillian's uncle, Judge Robert Schieber, even made it in the movie as an extra. My wife and I are going to bring him little laser pointers to the movie with us when, when we see the movie. And when the search team comes on, I'm going to point the little laser because there we are, there we are. At number three. Ready, aim, fire. I got it. Bob Colson didn't set his sights on inventing the ultimate rubber band gun. I think you beat me. And at first, he didn't. Yes. So I made the one with the clothespin. His six-year-old son rejected it. Then he had specific demands for his woodworker dad. No glue. No glue. He said, I don't want glue, dad, because he didn't want to wait to let it dry to play with it. So about 100 times later, Bob finally created the ultimate rubber band gun. Every piece made locally. All you do is just hook it on the front and go down. On your mark, get yep. set, go. I got five. Dang. <laughs> I got two, I got, at least I had some. There's more than one way to send the bands flying. Looks like high noon. 10 paces. And a couple different sizes to win any rubber band rumble. Now you're caught up and clued in around Kansas City. 